Hey guys, what's up? It's Monk Zunky. So in this video, I decided to actually try out some necks with Mage because I did recently get the Furtis one in book, and I just thought, you know, this has been so great for Slayer. And my friend here said that there, it was pretty good for Mage as well. Um, and he's a pretty good next tank and all, and he said, you know, you should try out some Mage. So I, in this video, I just kind of wanted to give you guys a few tips on how to kill Nex with Mage, or just in general, um, if you want to duo, possibly even trio. I wouldn't recommend duoing if you haven't done much Nex, or if you're going for your first time. I'd recommend going with like three or four people. Um, three or four people total, not three or four people with you, because then it's just, if you get a split with five people, that's not usually a very good split is what I'm trying to say but anyway so next with Virtus Wan and Book was actually pretty surprisingly good it's still I would say Drygors uh, are a little better damage output wise however um, with Virtus Wan and Book it was um, not as bad as you think as long as you're wearing the Amulet of Zealots the biggest tip that I can give to you guys um, if you want to next or improve your nexting experience is buy an amulet of zealots from the dungeoneering rewards master it costs 40k dungeoneering tokens and wear it and basically what it does is it makes um, all your prayers have 10% more effect uh, it does not count with curses doesn't count with turmoil or the ranger mage version of turmoil um, but f so you have to be on regular prayers but um, yeah if you're using regular prayers with the amulet of zealots, just use all the magic boosting prayers, um, and you're going to be hit, doing some serious damage. And it really, really helps increase your accuracy and stuff. It's a lot better than turmoil is. Um, even though you're using regular prayers, the only bad thing is if you ever need soul split for slayer or something, you have to um, go back to the terminal place and change your prayers, which can be really annoying. But uh, anyway. You can pretty much see the basic gist of what I'm doing in the background. Um, you do need to bring a range switch because you cannot hit the minions with mage. They just have super high defense versus mage, so that does not work very well. Um, if you want, you can also use like a scrimshaw of the elements. Uh, they they cost about 400k in the GE or something, and they also boost your magic accuracy by I believe 5% if you're interested in mage DPSing. So that can help out a little bit as well. Um, and then gear wise, I just brought Sea Singer's hood and top, and I don't have Sea Singer's legs yet. I still need about 30 chi to get those. Um, so I was just wearing subjugation legs, which is fine. It's not a big deal because uh, the subjugation legs have the same accuracy as the sea singers and defense isn't the biggest problem like we only do three kills a trip and you easily have enough food for three kills with a yak full of sharks and yeah I don't bring rock tails because um, well it's kind of hard to bring rock tails when you have enough food for everything that you need even if you just bring sharks and rock tails are much more expensive so anyway um, we're closing up on the end of the kill here and you'll see what I get but um, anyway, yeah, this next with mage is really actually a lot easier than melee because you take a lot less damage. Uh, even in Tetsu with melee, you do just take a lot of damage because um, Nex's magic attacks just really hurt you in Tetsu because, of course, Tetsu has no defense against magic. Um, but anyway, you know, I really enjoyed Nexing with Furtis Wan and Book. I'm going to try it out more. Um, I think it's a tiny bit slower than Drygors, but it's definitely a lot easier, and we're slowing down the clip for some reason. Why could it be? Oh, I got a drop. Yes, I did. And it's uh, Torva Boots. So I was pretty excited about that. That's my second drop that I've ever gotten uh, on the floor to me. My fourth neck split in total. So anyway, that's my second pair of neck boots. Last time I got them, and they were Last time I got a drop from Nexus, it was Virtus Boots. This time it was Torva Boots. So, anyway, I'm very, very happy about that. Uh, it wasn't the biggest split. It ended out being, well, you'll see how much it is in just a second uh, when I show the clip of me selling it. But, um, anyway, yeah, so Torva Boots Duo, that's pretty cool. My last drop was Virtus Boots Duo. Um, maybe next I'll get Pernix Boots Duo. Who knows? Actually, I really hope I get a Virtus Swan. But, anyway, I'm going to be doing more next in the future. Um, I hope I could give you guys a couple decent tips in this video but yeah just get the amulet of zealots um, whether you're maging whether you're mailing whether you're ranging it's really 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 good uh, but you just do have to use regular prayers with it which is okay it's not that big of a deal but anyway um, so yeah I'm just doing the split right now and we each got eight mil cash so that was pretty nice I made eight mil in like an hour of nexing 
and I got I more I made actually um 9.5 mil because I got some torstals and some lantidimes and some dwarf weeds and something else. But anyway, yep, that's about all for this video. Thank you guys for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed, and I'll see you all later.